The Life and Sad Ending of Wendy Malick Wendy Malick was born as Wendy Malick on December 13, 1950 in Buffalo, New York to Ken Malick, a sales executive, and Gigi, a former model. Her paternal grandfather was an Egyptian. Her other ancestry is German, French, and English. She initially studied at Williamsville South High School and later attended Ohio Wesleyan University in Delaware, where she graduated from in 1972. In 1982, Wendy Malick married actor cum screenwriter Mitch Glazer. The couple divorced in 1989, following which Malick went on to tie the knot with Richard Erickson. She has no kids. Currently, she is living with her second husband in Santa Monica. She also has a cat, two horses, and three dogs. Malick is on the board of directors of Planned Parenthood, as well as the Environmental Media Association. She also serves on the advisory board of the nonprofit organization the Humane Society of the United States. Wendy Malick initially started her film career in fashion modeling, working for the Wilhelmia Modeling Company. She made her acting debut in 1978 with the made-for-television film How to Pick Up Girls. In 1982, she was featured in the flick A Little Sex. The following year, she was cast in the role of Dr. Bridget Blaine in the ABC medical drama Trauma Center. From 1985 to 1989, Malick had a reoccurring role in the sitcom Kate and Allie. During this time, she also made guest appearances in a number of programs, including Another World, Scarecrow and Mrs. King, Highway to Heaven, Super Carrier, The Highwayman, Hunter, and Anything But Love, to name a few. In 1989, the actress began playing the reoccurring role of Gail Buchanan in the series Baywatch, starring David Hasselhoff. The action drama series was about the Los Angeles County lifeguards who watch over the beaches of Los Angeles County in California. The series went on to become one of the most watched TV shows in the world. In 1990, Malik joined the cast of the series Dream On as Judith Tupper Stone. She also was featured in three episodes of the Finelli Brothers the same year. Soon after this, she starred in the TV movie Dynasty The Reunion. In the ensuing years, the actress had guest roles in numerous television dramas such as Civil Wars, The Human Factor, NYPD Blue, Love and War, Mad About You, and Tales from the Crypt, to name a few. She played Susan Sloan in The American President, a romantic drama movie about President Andrew Shepard, a widower who pursues a relationship with lobbyist Sidney Ellen Wade. In the year 1996, Malix appeared as a series regular in the sitcom Good Company. That year, she also played the character of Pat Collins in the television docudrama flick Apollo 11. From 1997 to 2003, Wendy Malick played Nina Van Horn, a shallow former supermodel on NBC's sitcom Just Shoot Me. The show followed a team of employees at the fictional fashion magazine Blush. Malick's performance was much appreciated and earned two Primetime Emmy Award nominations and one Golden Globe Award nomination. She was also nominated for Satellite Award for Best Actress, Television Series, Musical, or Comedy in 2001. From 2002 to 2003, the actress contributed her voice to Principal Folsom, a character in Disney's animated series Fillmore. During this time, she also voiced the character Victoria the Tiger in Father of the Pride, as well as appearing in a reoccurring role in Frasier. Malick next starred in the series Jake Progress as Naomi Clark, a role she played between 2005 and 2006. During this time period, she also had voice work in the series The Exes and Brats, and featured in the films Racing Stripes and Waiting. She was given the opportunity to play Jane in the sitcom Big Day from 2006 to 2007. In 2009, the American actress played Miss Brennan in the comedy drama movie Adventureland. The same year, she starred in Confessions of a Shopaholic, a romantic comedy by P.J. Hogan based on Sophie Kinsella's Shopaholic series of novels. In 2010, the actress was cast as Victoria Chase, a six-time divorced soap opera star in the comedy series Hot in Cleveland. The series also starred Jane Levis, Betty White, and Valerie Bertinelli. It won generally positive reviews from critics. Malik and her classmates earned a Screen Actors Guild Award nomination under the category Outstanding Performance by an Ensemble in a Comedy Series. Wendy Malik began voicing Feng Huang in Kung Fu Panda Legends of Awesomeness in 2011. 
In 2014, she began contributing to the animated series BoJack Horseman as Beatrice Horseman and Young Beatrice. She was cast as Captain Cole in the police procedural comedy drama Rush Hour in 2016. During this time, she also had reoccurring roles in Pitch and Kulapari in Army of Frogs. From 2016 to 2018, Malik featured as Catherine in nine episodes of American Housewife. During this time, she also had a role in The Ranch, a fictional web series about the life of a dysfunctional family named The Bennetts that includes two brothers, their father, and his estranged wife. The Netflix series also features Ashton Kutcher, Deborah Winger, Danny Masterson, Sam Elliott, and Alicia Cuthbert. The sadness that she has encountered in the loneliness in the eyes, the images of a happy family always burning in her mind. It could be a date, less pain, less sadness. What we learn over time is to mature and realize that mindfulness is something that life will be easy and peaceful.